Okay, everyone, you got your jade pillars ready? Now chant, Ma Mulana! Very good, you just summoned a Let's Play. Now come back to La Mulana 2. Previously, we gained the power of words from an evil sea camel machine thing. Also, we're back to being regular Lumisa again. And we, I guess we got a crystal skull last time too. But most importantly, we have the jet pillar and a handful of mantras. So we can mantra things. I wonder what Zelda has to say about mantras. That's a jet pillar. It turns mantras into physical form or something. You have to be able to choose which mantra to repeat, though. So it's not useful to him. He has a harem. I wonder how he's doing with his day. Eglana is taking a while. His job was to seal La Milana. He didn't hear about any Eglanas. Well, he's running out of money, as we learned from the last time. I wonder how Elsa Darna is doing. I mean, we don't speak to him because he's off, you know, up here. He's being antisocial. That's who he's being. Now that Lamalan is sealed, the philosophers have nothing to do. The Fairy Queen likes to live with the, you know, leadership and all that. But Al Sadarna's taking it easy. He wants people to chill. Well, he's a nice guy. I like him. Why can't Zilpa be more like him? Speaking of which, hey Nibber! I'll buy some weights, I'll buy some weights, I'll buy some weights, and then I won't. That'll never cease to amuse me. Alright, uh, we should check in on some more people. Because I don't want anybody to get into a Mulbrook situation. Let's go visit Phobos. Of course I'm gonna have to go back this way. You know this way. Maybe he has some item hints for us. Maybe he could tell me how to get that item that I was looking for a few videos ago. Oh, he's having mommy issues. Actually, everyone's having mommy issues. So, El Sedona might be dying because he misses the mother. Or, the mother is making him miss the mother. That's more accurate. Phobos is just fine because he has his apple pen. Ah, you said this before, though. Maybe he doesn't miss her as much as he thinks he does. Yeah, he misses her a whole bunch now. He was saying other things before, I think. Anyway. Uh, talk to Elsa Darna. No, let's check in on King Frey. I killed a... Uh, Kujata for him. Yeah, I got a Jed Pillar to prove it. Also, there's some data right here. There's a breakable wall. See how it's different than the other wall? Break that to get the free data. In fact, I haven't been checking my data. We got a Heimdall. He's the Acer race of the fifth children. He's waiting for the coming of the end. Near to Bifurst. He'll be released when it's time for Eglana to be destroyed. Ah, so that's what the end means. King Frey. The Alpha Tribe of Six Children. He's rebelling against the mother. He's naughty. But he has a good purpose, though. The mother's killing people. Killing entire races. Anything else here? Who are these guys? Oh, yes, the Clairvoyance Lady. She opened the way to Kajada. And Pim, the, the shop seller. I didn't get ripped off. I got Scanner out of the whole deal. Anything here? Korobok? Nothing interesting about him. Still haven't checked the, the shopkeepers out at all. I, in fact, I think I know where Neber is. Maybe I should get that. This jerk! He tricked us into getting Vritra. We killed it, and he liked that. And we got Isis. We got Horus. He has the eyes of Wajet. Hey, that's a puzzle in the original Amalana. And Nephthys. Now, Egyptian mythology all over the place in the Gate of the Dead, if you haven't noticed. Any more glossaries to read? Well, of course we know about Bargain Duck. Yeah, I think we got everything now. 
I think we're caught up. Oh, wait. Man, if we go through these glossaries, we'll be here all day. Get the game and look at them yourselves. Oh, no. Frey's weapon. Gerd stole it. If we could get the flame torque back, we could control flames with it. So maybe that has to do with his hand being missing. You got anything else for us, anyway? Oh, that's ominous and creepy. Frey isn't feeling too good, either. Now, I, I hope Freya could uh, pick up the slack if he decides to, you know, kick the fairy bucket. Well, there's some more things you could do in the Anufin now that I can mantra. Well, actually, there's one thing I could do now that I can mantra. And it's pretty useful. I'm gonna go grab it right now. I think I'm in the right spot. No, actually, I have to go right a screen. I have to go and take the lift again. This lift right here. It's taken off without me. We're gonna go back to the Kajada room. And that's not the way to Kajada room. That's the way to Ghost. Die! I said die, not throw ghosts at me. Ah. Let's try this one more time. Also, notice the little uh, graphic down there next to the lift thing. You can actually see where the lift is. Yeah, that one has it too, but it's off to the left instead. Uh, actually, this is where I get off. I don't want to go up there. I'm done with up there. We're going into this side. Let's take this way. Because there's data here. It's data for the Kajada! More glossary data! Yay! Joy! It's a gigantic bull holding up the ground itself. Well, actually, wasn't he walking on an ocean? He wasn't holding up any ground. He's so large that nobody could see it. Wait, I, I could see it just fine. Wait a second, he bleeds rubies? I did not get a single ruby out of him. I think that glossary is lying. All these glossaries are lying to me. Maybe. One thought just came into my head, though. Egalana is supposed to be a copy of the mother, right? That's what uh, Phobos found out? And it's holding the originals. Yeah, it's a copy of the mother that's holding the originals of the things the mother made. Did the mother actually make these, or did other people make them? That's a mystery that we'll have to solve on another time. Let's go down here. Now we belong in this room. We have another one of those busts of Mimir just hanging out. And I'll just say Earth at it. Yeah, that's the solution. How did I know how to do that? Well, I, I just said Yoro. By accident. I wanted to scan it. But at, at least we got a response out of it. And it's the Silver Shield. This shield could get bounced away, but it won't break like the Buckler. So, we're better equipped for projectiles now. There seems to be a lot in this game. The Golden Rock keeps the crystal from ascending to heaven. I've seen the Golden Rock, but it tries to kill me whenever I break that pillar. So, let's not mess with that rock just yet. Is there any data in this room? Any different walls? Is there a different wall over here? Behind these pots? Data? I want to get more inaccurate glossary things. Well, I can't seem to make that jump. That's a problem. Yeah, at least we could pedestal. But there seems to be something glowing up there. I'm just gonna farm togs. Also, we got chest, but we don't have solution. And we can't get solution just yet. Invoke the power of Earth. So that's how you get the shield in this room. There's a few other places we can invoke Earth, too, but, uh, let's go other places while I block these arrows. I wasn't even looking. You know what? Mobrook has done her mission that I gave her. I think it's time to give the intern a new mission. She needs to learn how to combat archaeology. Because she got caught by a noose in the last video. She was being silly. So, we've been in the ruins for a while now. Do you understand La Milanese yet? Oh, yeah, the Sigils. So, Lamalani's numbers, you get one, two, three, and four. We don't have a four. Oh, she forgot the rest. 
I think those cheeseburgers are melting your brain. No, I'm good, thanks. She's gonna get some sleep now. No, no sleeping for you. If you stay there for a while, she does lay down. Ah, uh, you already checked the Anufin and it went badly. How about the Immortal Battlefield? We haven't been everywhere in the Immortal Battlefield yet. So go to it. Meanwhile, we should do some exploring of our own. She went up, how about we go down? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. There's some things on a down we haven't looked at yet. I was avoiding spikes. That's how I avoid spikes, by taking damage. Don't question it. The power of Katana slays you! So, I haven't been down, uh, over there. That way. Let's go that way. As long as you're lateral to spikes, they can't spike you. Which is good. Yeah, that coin, that's a trap door right there on that pot. That's why I'm being ginger with it. The Spiral Boat! It protects the Spiral of Life and the Spiral of Hell. There's two sigils by falling water. One of them leads to the Spiral Boat. Yay, a switch! Boo, a switch! Ah, that's the worst kind of switch. Speaking of which, uh, this game is going to be coming to the Nintendo Switch next spring. You see, I triggered that trap just to let you know about the Nintendo Switch happening. Ah, stupid cheese balls. You die now. Also, uh, whenever you get an alarm call from one of these guys, those Sephiroth doors are just going to spew out soldiers. At least for a little while. A path leading outside. No one can escape because you fall off a cliff. Indicating this guy being here, the Varuna Idol. The Guardian of Death and Terminus. He guards the west direction where everyone dies. Like that cheese ball. He's looking right at that cheese ball now. Also, he's holding a ton of skulls. And this wall is passed throughable. I don't know why this is here. Anything in it? No. Also, we got machines. Yep. It's that kind of place. Welcome to Cavern. It's still technically the Immortal Corridor. Or the... Why do I keep on calling things Corridor? There's only one Corridor in this game. Actually, two. But there's Mantra in here. Let's just take a picture in midair. Violate physics as we learn about the Ennead. Searing light endured by the dwarves. Soul! That's another Mantra. That's a useful mantra. There's a lot of mantra combinations you're gonna have to remember. Oh, costume chest time. I opened this one too. That unlocks the Valkyrie outfit. That looks pretty cool. Hey, look, I'm Norse now, like everybody else. Oh yeah, this has been fixed. Before, this was a completely black room. But now it's a precipice. You will die if you fall down there. This won't be important later, but at least it's a really good view. That's a cool view, I like that. I never got to see that until just now. That was new for me, too. Yeah, that jump is a little funky right there, but you could jump on a pixel and then you could jump up high enough. So that's it for the cavern. I have the soul mantra now. That's good. No, don't sound the alarm again. In fact, I'm gonna jump right here. Yay, money! I'm gonna need some money soon. I wanna buy some fairies. Not weapon fairy, of course. Weapon fairy is poop. I hate the poop fairy. Thank you, machine. You saved me. Hmm, this door doesn't seem to be open. I wonder how we could open it. Ah, they sounded an alarm. Oh well, they can just stand there with their guns. It's Skip Dagger! I like calling him Skip Dagger. I don't know what his real name is. Also, where's my shield? It's Valkyrie versus Knight. Valkyrie's gonna win. This is for honor too. This is how it's gonna look. Nope, no thank you. Oh, you can crouch too. I hate that. Nope, I killed Skip Dagger. This room's gonna be important later, so note it. The Corona Arsenal. We're gonna have to come back here because there is a different kind of laser eye in this room. It's the Eye of Divine Reckoning, but it's red. 
It's dangerous. It's more powerful than the blue eye. Oh, hey, this one I could do. I'm gonna have to signal it, though. And that opens the thing for me. Uh, I see mashers, though. I don't want to mess with no mashers. Yeah, I'm not messing with no mashers. Not without this in the way. Run! Don't get squished! Okay, now you can get squished. Go back in there. And use your spear real quick, because that's gotta pass through the floor. Wait for it... Dead traps everywhere! I waited. I'm smart. I'm archaeologist! That thing will keep on mashing. You just gotta wait for it. I'm only gonna die to dead traps if I feel like it, because otherwise I'm gonna go back to a, my last autosave, and I don't want to do that. Step together! You might think it has to do with the skeleton. No, the skeleton is poop. Ah, I can't kill it! It's blue! Drat. No, it means step together with a rolling shuriken. Come on, rolling shuriken! Stupid skeletons I can't kill. At least it could fall apart when I hit them. I got the Shock Room! Shock Room is less great in this game as it was before. If it hits anything, it'll destroy itself. Yeah, it doesn't come back to you like it does in the original game. It's not as great. Alright, now I'm gonna have to run this thing backwards. I hope it doesn't try mashing me backwards. It tries to mash you backwards! Don't trust that trap. Just keep running. Never stop running. Things want to kill you, Lamiza. Ah, if I only had double jump, I could make that. I'm gonna have to find another way around. Because I do want to get down in there. Also, why I want to get that seal, and I want to get that pedestal. Yeah, I know. There's a secret shop there. Let me get to it. There's lots of other things I could do in the Immortal Battlefield. I'm tired of wasting weights on that door. I'm gonna go down this way instead. Yeah! Okay, that's the spiral boat that leads to sp spiral life and spiral death. That's not the prophecy tablet. I want that. I think I'm going the wrong way for that. Yeah, I'm definitely going the wrong way for that. I'm gonna have to kill the Kraken now. Wow, that takes a lot of hits. But it was the Kraken. More data! I haven't looked at these guys, but they're probably losers. Giant squid! Pretty obvious. Oh, water is from the roots of Yggdrasil here. I've been hearing it pronounced Yggdrasil. Hey, is that a butt? That's a butt. Dodo Manler, why are you putting butts on my Lama Lana? You're ridiculous. So obviously we can't drop down that way to get where I need to go, because we don't have water. And I don't really want to deal with the water just yet. So let's go... this way, maybe? Anything up here? No. Uh, oh, actually, this is a, isn't that... Uh, I haven't been in this store, have I? No, I don't remember you! I remember your cup, though. So Nibiru... It's the place of the Anunnaki. So the Anunnaki are those weird alien skull dudes that are leaving the bad notes. It's on the other side of a dark star. Oh, thanks, Soma! Yep, creepy Soma dude. He looks like a zombie. He's probably Lokapala. I bet he's Lokapala. And survey says... Lokapala! Yep! If they look like evil zombies, they gotta be Lokapala. Well, except for that dude that doesn't look like an evil zombie. But he's also Lokopala, and he had spears and golden armor, and he probably wanted to hurt me in terrible ways. I'm looking for puzzles to solve. Have you seen any? You see a sword to the face. Can't get in here just yet, and I've already raided Lameza's tent. This I can't open yet until way, way later in the game. I'm just gonna have to murder cheese balls that dare to defy physics. We can't go this way because we need to do things. But we can get to that other side. Yeah, let's not, uh... Let's not do that right now. This I could probably do. 
Yeah, I think there's a breakable wall there. Get down here. Get down here. I want to kill you. Thank you. If you ask nicely, they'll let you make them die. So shurikens can't make this. Shurikens don't go through walls. Spears do. Oh, uh, sorry about that. I threw too many spear. And now we could sigil. That's the birth sigil, I think. And it opens a ladder for us, too. That's helpful. Wait, does that go... That goes into the spiral room, doesn't it? Or is it too far left? It's in the spiral room! Well, this is a shortcut I never knew existed until now. Yeah, yeah, I, I did this late in the game, actually. But this is how you open that door. You bird seal there. And there's a one-way door all the way over here. Look at all this stuff. Look how fancy this looks. There's a nine-soul door and a weird-looking gate. For some reason, I'm, I'm having anger towards that gate, and I'm not quite sure why. It's a familiar anger, though. Very familiar. I'm thinking... I'm thinking about, um... You know, some kind of lingerie. That's just silly. Molnir, the power of storms! Well, that's what happened to Thor's storm powers. He lost his hammer. Yeah, I think, uh, the Urmungand has it. And this seems like a room that has a Urmungand in it. Maybe. Well, it's Urmungand's room. And I just killed a UFO with a sword. It was a Vimana. Where is Vimana on here? It could drop bombs, but they explode. That's a spoiler. Flying machine, though. Mass-produced by the Locopala. Man, they have some technology things going on. Also, we got another breakable wall. That leads here! To the backside grail points! Like I said before, this is like twin labyrinths. So, yeah, it's all together in one. Oh, hey, that looks like Yermungand. Yermungand Seal. So it's kind of all mech, kind of, sorta. Also, there's a way to get up into that room. I'm gonna have to find it. I think I have to... I'm gonna have to flood this place. I can't even get up to the, the sigil now. I'm probably gonna have to flood this place to get that, too. But we could go here. There's so much good stuff going on in this room. Like, uh, these L balls. He just summoned guys, didn't he? Acquire the Illuminating Ring of Power. I already did that. That's the puzzle solution for the Chakram. You see there's the Mashers and the other Masher? That mashes you if you think you're not going to get mashed. So, there seems to be a Dragon Idol in here. Some kind of dinosaur. Well, I can't mess with that just yet. I don't even know what it's for. Why would I mess with things I don't know what they're for? Unless they're gold. Ah, you and your stupid bombs and your whistles. Bomb whistles. Every local Paul has a bomb and a whistle. Virtue is measured akin to the number of ox hooves. That is so silly, I'm gonna have to say that. It's wrote by the Kodo, Mas Kodo Amatsu. More of the first children. Also, we got this thing here. The Light of Time. Perpetual Engine, you say? Sounds like we need time powers. Sounds like I need to kill a werewolf. Sounds like I need shields. It sounds like a lot of things. Mostly war sounds. Oh yeah, Mobrick was trying to call me this entire time. It's a huge maze. I know, it's everywhere. A lot of paths are closed off and we gotta do things to get them working. She's still here in the immortal battlefield and so am I. There's lava! Are you telling me there's a Muspelheim down there? Because that would be rather accurate, wouldn't it? Oh wait, no. Okay, where we go? Roots of Yggdrasil, down to Anufin, then down more through the Bifrost to get to here. It can't possibly, right? It can't be the Muspelheim, because we go up from the roots to get to there. It's the Muspelheim! Well, actually, it's the Niflheim section. We haven't been here. Hmm, do we have some time? 
I don't have some time. I don't think I have time for what I want to do here. But we'll do that next time. Also, do, I think there's some more other things I gotta open. I gotta flood the immortal battleground. Ah, archaeology is so busy! Good night, folks.